All right, nearly 60% of Florida's registered voters have already cast their ballots. Even though registered Democrats had submitted more vote by mail ballots, registered Republicans had almost 845,000 more votes combined than Democrats. CBS News Miami's Peter Dench picks up our team coverage from Miami Dade Election Headquarters in Doral. Peter? Well, Lauren and Elliot, we can tell you that election supervisors say there has been a strong turnout through early in-person voting and through mail-in ballots. In Miami-Dade, it's 57 percent. In Broward, more than 59 percent. That's where we caught up with some voters. Cecilia Whitehead was determined to make her vote count, dropping off her ballot at Broward Elections Headquarters. Um, it's really important to me, uh, me and my family, we've always, you know, considered um, voting very important. Janus Lackey says he feels obligated to vote on every single election day. I believe the country is going to be better if the people vote and make their voices heard. There are nine sites in Broward where you can drop off your mail-in ballot through Election Day. Election Supervisor Joe Scott says you can find out online where they are. If you go to BrowardVotes.gov on our website, we have them all listed out. We have a cool little map that you can put in any address in Broward County and it'll tell you which one is closest to you. There are 358 precincts in Broward. On Election Day, you must vote at your assigned polling place, and your assigned polling place is based on where you live today. In Miami-Dade, there are 523 voting locations. This online voter tool allows you to plug in your information to figure out where you need to go. Election Supervisor Christina White notes. I know that the hours of operation are from 7 a.m. to 7 p.m. Don't wait until the last minute. I understand it's going to be a rainy day tomorrow, so get it out of the way nice and early. And be sure to bring a photo ID that contains a signature. In Miami-Dade, there are just two locations to drop off mail-in ballots at elections headquarters and in downtown Miami. Now, both election supervisors in Miami-Dade and Broward County say they are not expecting any serious problems tomorrow. One final note, they say that you can wear Trump and Harris shirts when you vote, but you're not allowed to campaign for any candidates within 150 feet of a precinct. We are live in Doral, Peter Dench, CBS News, Miami. That line at the polling place is sacred. You can't cross it, Peter. Thank you.